New at 11 with less than a week now before the solar eclipse, you can get a preview of exactly what it's going to look like. Channel 2's Carl Willis is live in Northeast Atlanta. He shows us the high tech display at one local museum. Carl? Well, we've seen this display twice here in this planetarium. It's almost like the real thing. It may even be better than the real thing, depending on the weather next Monday. Cannot wait. I'm just looking to see something really cool. Visitors at the Fernbank Science Center Planetarium are being treated to a simulation of the big day when we experience a solar eclipse. This is just some way to make it really concrete. It's more than just something that we read in a book. They'll remember this experience. Planetary geologist Scott Harris ran a few scenarios from them, from totality up in Rabin County to the more subtle changes expected in Atlanta. Seeing if the horizon looks any different, seeing does it get red, does the sky get silvery, does the temperature drop any? Harris says we can all hope for that great moment, but if weather doesn't cooperate, then there's always Fernbanks Planetarium. Not to mention much smaller ways of experiencing the eclipse, like looking at the light filtering through leaves. Look for the light filtering through those holes and you could actually see the moon taking a bite out of the sun. And now folks have a clear idea of what to expect and how quickly this will all be gone. I just like how it's just going to be like, just like a flash of dark for two minutes. I think it's definitely what you want to make of it, but this was definitely very cool, very surreal. And there will be more shows here on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, as well as two free showings and a day full of activities next Monday. Reporting live in DeKalb County, Carl Willis, Channel 2 Action News, Nightbeat. Of course, Carl, everyone is talking about this eclipse, so we're counting down to Monday. Thank you. We also want you to watch where you park if you're traveling to the North Georgia Mountains for next Monday's solar eclipse. Federal officials will close roads along the Chattahoochee National Forest because the paths are just too narrow for the traffic. And they also say they will tow away any cars blocking certain roadways.